Hi guys, welcome to Sutton Stops. Today we're gonna to do something a little bit different. I'm here at the Junior League of Houston, someplace I've never been, I've never experienced it, but I've heard a lot about it. And I'm here with my friend, Lady Mary Beth. You guys go check out her channel. If you think you can't do anything fancy or you don't know how to set a table, this lady can show you how. Today she's invited me to come along for the Bubbles and Brunch. It's a three course brunch and bottomless mimosas, hello. It's in a beautiful part of Houston. This is the Galleria area. And we also get to see a fashion show. It's the Lily Pulitzer collection. And I'm excited to see the clothes. I Googled it a little bit because I wanted to know what it looked like. So I'm excited to bring you guys with us. So this is my friend, Lady Mary Beth, that I was telling you about. I'm gonna have her explain a little bit about the Junior League because this is something she's involved in and she knows a lot about. So give us a little insight. Hi there, everyone. The Junior League was started in 1925 by 12 visionary women to fund a well baby clinic. And it has developed into an army of 5,000 women with a servant's heart who do a lot for the community, the care clinic at Texas Children's Hospital, free CPR classes twice a week here at the Junior League. They just do amazing things and I'm glad to support them. It's nice to host events here and to attend because you know that anything that you do is benefiting the community. I've heard about it off and on but never knew exactly what it was about. This is incredible. It really is. And, and I'm it's, so always, excited. it's always fun to go to the leagues. I'm excited for Gina to join me today for <laughs> I get Bubbles to be, and Breath. I get to be fancy today. Yes. That's to dress up and be colorful and fancy. I'm very excited. It is absolutely stunning. Very, very good details in this room. I feel so fancy. I'm afraid to touch everything in here. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit and enjoy this living room for a little while. <laughs> One of the bottomless mimosas. We got a choice of peach, cranberry, orange, or pineapple. I got peach and had little pieces of peach in there. I got Mary Beth an orange one and she's got raspberries and blackberry. I think I'm gonna get the brunch salad, the eggs benedict. I think I'm gonna get that lemon curd too because it says it's served in a lace basket. That just sounds pretty. And Love with it. the orange rolls it's perfect. It keeps that citrus flavor. These are a problem. They're addictive. They're so good. The and you can actually purchase them, right? Yes. Orange roll. This smells so good. <laughs>
nice. But look at that hollandaise sauce. Mary Beth got chicken, chicken and biscuits, fried chicken. That eggs Benedict is really good. Nice hollandaise sauce, not too lemony. They brought Mary Beth some tea. Yes. There's the dessert. The lemon curd mousse. It's a lace basket with raspberries. Not sure what the basket is made of, but it looks like caramel. Looks amazing. I gotta mm. taste this crust because I'm curious. Oh, this is so good. Mmm. It's like brittle. Oh my gosh, that's really good. I could just eat the basket. Mm -hmm. This lemon curd mousse is to die for. Super light and airy, and really tastes the lemon. It reminds me of like a lemon ice box pie, but without the crust. But this part is like brittle. Holy moly, so good. I just spoiled it. I spoil. Just relaxing at home. Too. I know this is great. Oh, well, if this was my house, I'd probably never leave. I know. <laughs> we got to dress nice. So tell me what you're wearing. Well, I'm wearing a cabbie top with Silpata Howlite vintage necklace. So I wore these silk pants. These are fun. It's the debut for these silk pants. And I got these at Goodwill oh about a year gosh. ago, and I had them clean. They've been sitting in my She's closet. Busy. I love shopping at Goodwill. You'd be surprised what's there. Exactly. Really surprised what people get rid of. I don't have a ton of bright things in my wardrobe. I do have blue shirts and I got a yellow belt and a yellow flower because I used to wear flowers all the time. Kind of Hollywood 40s and 50s look a lot. It's so retro classic. Yes. Jana, you look fabulous oh, today. I was so pleased to be with you. <laughs> and your white linen pants are perfect. And these are, I have been so excited to wear these because I haven't worn them in about four years and these are from Italy. This is one of the things I got when I went to Italy and I just had to have them because they tailored them to you. So these are my white linen pants from Rome. Oh, and your shoes. You your... have to show them oh, your shoes. Oh, yeah. These, these are hard to walk in, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I've been tiptoeing around today because I haven't worn really tall heels in a while. So that was, that was fun. But I felt like a lady because I was taking little bitty steps the whole time. <laughs> yes, they are fabulous, Jane. Thank you. Your jewelry accents. Oh, yeah. I never get to wear the yellow. So I was like, I didn't get to wear you know, it. And I don't have a lot of yellow in my wardrobe. I don't either. But it looks so good with the royal. I never would have thought. Thank you guys for joining us. And thank you for letting me share this with you. And thank you for collaborating with me. That was really Absolutely. fun. I so enjoyed it. We've been good friends for a while. So this was really nice to do together. And you guys make sure you check out her channel. Thank you for joining me too. And remember, Sutton Stops make the best adventures. To learn more about the Junior League of Houston and all the things we talked about today, follow the links below in the description. And thank you guys so much for joining us. See you next time.